Renee Hesselink and I am a board member of the USGBC West Michigan as well as the chair for the advocacy team for the Green Schools. We started working and had a great relationship with Grand Rapids Public Schools which is our largest school district in West Michigan probably eight years ago and through a lot of transitions in the school districts we lost some of our relationships and then the, there was a superintendent change two years ago which positioned us very well to integrate ourselves in the school district they created a green team and invited me to be part of that so I just kept bringing ideas to them and finally the green school fellow idea they kind of jumped on that and we started to explore talk to um, Center for Green Schools and we got her in place in September of 2014 so we're thrilled about that. One of the projects that we've been working on and getting a lot of attention from Lansing is our Battle of Buildings competition which started in 2014 and we had 63 buildings, um, commercial buildings that participated uh, which was about 11 million square feet of space and because that was so successful last year, we rolled that out to the entire state of Michigan, and now we have, oh, I don't remember the number of buildings, <laughs> but about 22 million square feet. It doubled in, in size this year. Schools in Michigan have really been struggling with many things, but um, we've, we've tried to get the Green Ribbon Program launched, and, and the Department of Education had participated for three years with little interest from schools. So we have um, really tried to you know, get engaged with our school districts because they are struggling financially. They have cut positions, so you know, when you talk to a facility director, they don't have time to do anything extra. Um, so we find that most of our schools, if there's activity going on, any kind of sustainability activity, it's usually with a teacher. And so it's very limited um, and not district-wide typically. For schools, we step in and be a resource for schools. Um, you know, we've got so many tools through the Center for Green Schools that it just makes sense that we can easily offer them ideas, um, tools to use, and so that has been helpful for some of the facility directors. And you know, I'm thrilled about this award. I was a founding member of our chapter, which has been 10 years, well, probably 11 years now. Um, so it really means you know, a lot to be recognized, especially at the national level. I think this gives us definitely a platform to continue the work that we've been doing. We do have a lot of great design thinking going on in West Michigan, and um, you know, it's just a lot of collaboration between even competitors, so I think it just demonstrates that in West Michigan we've made a lot of things happen for many years already, so.